Hi everyone, I'm at Heathrow Airport preparing for a flight to Koh Chang, a small tropical Thai island just off the coast of Cambodia. I'll be checking out the nightlife, the food, the bars, the culture, the paradise beaches, and of course, anything else that happens to come along. Surathani Airport, Bangkok. I have arrived. First thing I'm going to do, get out here to the place where the taxis wait, and then catch the BART bus down to Koh San Road, and that's where it all begins. It's always been a ritual of mine that whenever I arrive in Thailand, the first thing I do is grab myself an authentic, traditional Thai green curry. And today is of no exception. So I've arrived in Rambutri where my hotel is. It's just on the other side of Koh San Road. Busy, busy, as you can see. So glad to be in Thailand. The amazing Manga Lagoon. Look at that, what an amazing swimming pool. This is the hotel where I've been staying. I didn't go into too much detail on my room and everything because I'm only here for one night. And then I'm heading off down to Koh Chang. But basically, this is the Manga Lagoon. Fantastic hotel. Saudi cap from beautiful Thailand. I'm bang in the middle of Bangkok. It's five o'clock in the morning. I don't actually do five o'clock in the morning, but on this occasion I am because I'm heading to Koh Chang Island. And to get there, I need to get the five o'clock bus. God almighty, things I do for you lot. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button, ring that little notification bell, and you'll be notified every time I'll bring you another one of these stupid videos where I have to wake up at five o'clock in the morning just to bring you some content. So excited about this one. What's this space? I'm catching this coach down to Kachambari, which is basically the coastline in South of Thailand, just outside Starbucks, um, off, the Kosan, off the end of the Koh San Road. Just got this little food place, loads going on here, plenty of food, it's like just a little restaurant. I got myself a nice iced coffee. That is the perfect hangover cure any day. Mm. Oh, mate, you've got to have one of these. Absolutely phenomenal, phenomenal. <laughs> After an hour on the road, it's time for another pit stop and uh, checked into this little place. Grab myself something to eat, go to the toilet as you do. That. Oh, fine selection of goodies here. Sausages for breakfast. Beautiful. This caught my eye as I stopped in the pit stop for breakfast. Look at these little plants. Well, big plants. I mean, I don't know what they are, but how beautiful is that? Amazing, massive leaves. Incredible. Proper little Thai kitchen, look. 
That's the cooking facilities. That's where it all gets cooked. This is the kitchen. Fantastic. That's my breakfast. A couple of strange looking sausages, an egg, some rice, and some lovely Thai green curry to go with it. No, you just don't get a breakfast like that, do you? That's just amazing. So, breakfast at the pit stop. Sausage, a bit of Thai green curry, egg, everything chucked in. Right. Happy days. It's a breakfast like you never had before, but welcome to Thailand. So just because it is Thailand, I'm going to be bloody rude not to. I've got myself some of this soup as well, you can't see very well. Look at that. Just so full of goodness, a bit of liver in there, a bit of greens, uh, and a bit of chicken, I think. I don't know. But so refreshing, so good. Just tuck into this fantastic little soup. Oh, cabbage, greens, all kinds of amazing things going on here. Look at that, it's just clear soup. It's so refreshing. So full of flavour. Wow. Oh my god. Absolutely amazing. There's chicken in here. All kinds of little, all kinds of little good things going on. It's just the, the flavour of the stock. So good. Mm. Finally, I'm on the ferry heading to Koh Chang Island, right up ahead of me. Must be about five years since I last visited this beautiful island. I've got to say, Koh Chang is definitely one of my favourite islands, and it'll be really interesting to see how much has changed in that time. Finally, I've arrived at Koh Chang and I've decided to check into the Hour Hotel. This is costing me £60 a night. Looking forward to this one. Let's go and check this place out. Right, this is my room. This is what you can expect for £60 a night at the A1 Hotel in Koh Chang. Nice size bathroom. Toilet, quite handy. Got a safe, fridge, coffee making equipment, and my room. Look at that. Big massive double bed, television. And as it is rainy season, it's quite a possibility I might actually be watching a bit of television. Look at that. Lovely view from the balcony. See if we can get out here. Where there's a wheel, there's a way. Oh, lovely little balcony, look at that. There you have it. 60 quid a night. Fanny's your aunt. Yeah.
have your omelets made for you. All of these. Pancakes. A bit of veggie bread looks like. Breakfast is included in the price and I've got the fried egg, some chips things, anemic sausage looking thing, but it is what it is. I'm not going to complain. I'm not going to do a review on this breakfast because to be honest with you, it is what it is. It's a hotel buffet breakfast. In the price and <laughs> better than some, but I wouldn't say it's the best breakfast I've had in a hotel. But it's the price, you'll see me through the day. It's included in the price, so it'd be rude not to have it. Fantastic. On appetit, as they say. Mm. Rice. Stir fry mix, seafood mix. Look at that, absolutely sport for choice here. This buffet is something to die for. That's like a Thai curry. Again, I don't know what's in it. Seafood probably. I'll find out in a minute when I eat it. And some soup. Look at that, absolutely amazing. Beach in the front of the hour hotel. Yeah. Lovely view, but not the best beach front I've been to. The water's a little bit murky. Uh, I don't think I'll be going swimming in the sea here. I'm going to stick to the swimming pool on this one. But yeah, this is the beach at the front of the hotel, which is there behind me, as you can see. 